Hello everyone and welcome back and once again today I'm going to be covering the Hipster Update DLC. A little bit more into the patch note side of things today, talking about some of the great additions that 1.14 has brought to the game, as well as talking about a statement that was made by Rockstar about heists. So if you do go on to enjoy today's video, all I ask is that you leave a like down below and maybe share the video with your friends as it really does help me out guys. Also my next video is going to be a brand new way to make ridiculous amounts of money and reputation really fast after patch 1.14. Make sure you drop a like down below if you want to see that, and as soon as we do hit a thousand likes, I'll be getting that out to you guys straight away. Anyway, without further ado, let's jump straight into this. Now before we do officially begin, I want to give a quick shout out to Official Granty. Some of you guys may have heard of him before, he actually had several channels terminated now, and he is back on YouTube, you guys can check him out in the description down below. But jumping straight into this, and we're going to start off with the Rockstar announcement that was made about Heist. So we're going to take this straight from the Newswire guys, if you guys want to check it out for yourselves, feel free to do so down in the description down below, a link to the Newswire will be down there. So the official Rockstar statement is going to be on screen right now and it says hello everyone we hope you are enjoying the new cars, weapons, gear, toasts and all of the other additions in this week's update. Then underneath that it states a paragraph about if anybody is experiencing any sort of technical issues then basically you can go to the website support.rockstargames.com and that's where you can report on your technical issues. Now underneath that is actually where the statement starts and it says for those of you asking about other upcoming GTA Online updates we have lots more in store coming your way soon. We know many fans have been eagerly awaiting the release of the online heist that we had planned to release for you this spring and they are taking more time to create than originally anticipated. We are very sorry for the delay and we are working hard to bring them to you as soon as we can. Please know that we are focused as always on making the best possible content for you to play and we are thankful to all of you for your patience, understanding and support. Stay tuned for more information on that as well as lots of ongoing content updates, enhancements and additions to the world of GTA Online that are on their way. So Rockstar have basically announced that heists have been delayed, they are trying to make it the best thing they can. Hopefully when it does arrive then it is going to be amazing because the delay is ridiculous, they keep delaying this guys and I know it's frustrating you as well as me. But hey, we are going to get them eventually and pretty soon at that as well. So yeah guys, that is the statement that Rockstar did make. Now I'm going to move on to the patch note side of things and I'm going to be discussing some of the new 1.14 editions that some of you out there may not actually know about. And before we do actually get into that, I want to quickly announce that the event weekend for the I Am Not Hipster update is going to be here Friday through Sunday, so make sure you guys get on GTA for that event weekend as you are going to be getting little bonuses, things like triple RP for kill streaks and headshots in death matches, and things like quadruple money for event crate drops. So make sure you guys are prepared for that event weekend. If you do want more details on the weekend itself, make sure you go down into the description down below, click the link, and you guys can check all the information out there. Anyway, moving back into the 1.14 additions, and one of the ones that stood out to me the most was, when a player dies, they now have a chance to detonate any sticky bombs they had placed. They must be detonated as soon as the wasted screen appears or they will be deleted. So that's definitely an addition a lot of you out there may not even have heard about and it's something that's very different to GTA 5. When you throw a sticky bomb at someone now, if they do kill you, you will have a short period of time to detonate it, which is definitely something, I guess it's a good addition in a sense, but it's a very weird one to me. Anyway, we're now going to move into the final part of the video and I'm going to be covering some of the exploit fixes that stand out to me the most. Starting at the top, they have basically patched the ability to maximize all your stats illegitimately which was the max stats glitch they have also fixed the play act or sorry the gate launch glitch which to me is really weird I don't know why they would patch the gate launch glitch where you could drive a car into the gate and it will fling your car into the air they've patched that they've also patched duplication glitches well, I'm presuming they're gonna be a new one very soon anyway they've also patched the single player cars to online glitch now that is gonna be a hard one I really do hope another one of them does come out as then you should be able to get any of the new DLC cars for free stay tuned on my channel you may be seeing one of them very soon they said they have patched the same bounty glitch which was the infinite bounty glitch which is a lie because I already know a way to get that back in online properly the same way as before I'm gonna go ahead and make a video on that for you guys very soon which is the infinite bounty glitch which basically means you can have infinite money and RP really fast way of gaining money and reputation Anyway guys, that is pretty much it for the video. I wanted to cover some of the exploit fixes that you may not have known about and of course a few additions that you may not have heard about as well. Anyway guys, that is pretty much it. So I hope you all enjoyed and I guess I will see you all in the next video.